The best mian shi lies in China, and the best Chinese mian shi lies in Shanxi. Can you imagine that in North China's Shanxi province, there are over 280 kinds of mian shi, or cooked wheaten food? Shanxi people's love for mian shi is closely related to the local natural conditions. The mountain and plateau-dominated terrain, with relatively dry weather, makes it suitable for growing wheat. Therefore, as time passing by, Shanxi people not only developed an appetite for wheaten food, but also invented various ways of cooking wheaten food. Among the many Shanxi mian shi, the sliced noodle is the most famous one. It is a noodle sliced with a special blade. When making it, the chef needs to hold the noodle with one hand, while fastly slicing the noodles into the soup pot with the other hand. The uniform slice length and thickness are the basic requirements. Experienced chef can even turn the noodle slicing process into a performance. They can slice 200 noodles in one minute and ensure each noodle falls exactly into the soup pot 1.5 meters away. Noodles in different regions of China are unique in their own way. Each has its own shape and flavor. In northwest China, where animal husbandry is developed, locals like to cook noodles in beef or mutton soup base. In southwest China, where spicy food is favored, the chilies and peppers are indispensable in local noodle recipe. And in southeastern coastal area, where seafood supply is ample. Ingredients like oysters, shrimps, and shellfishes are often added to the noodles. In Chinese food culture, people like to attach special meanings to cuisine and dishes. For example, they will have a bowl of Changshou Mian on their birthday, carrying good wishes for health and longevity. In many places, the custom is to serve jiaozi to a person leaving home and noodle a person returning home. As both food have their own symbolic meaning. Well, seeing all these Chinese mian shi, do you feel attracted? Which one would you like to try most? <laughs>